Hello Huskies, we are going to be finding conditional probabilities using two-way frequency tables. Our first example, Ivy went to Tiger football and basketball games. Here's our uh, frequency table. Uh, it's a little bit different than what you've seen in the Khan Academy as it doesn't have the totals, but this is what it's going to look like in the IXL exercises. What is the probability that a game she attended was a win given that it was a football game? So the key there, and all the IXLs are going to look very, very similar to this, which makes it easy, is you just, in the problem, look for the word given. That's going to tell you what the condition is. So when we see the word given in the problem, given that it was a football game, that is the condition. So football is all that matters to our problem. Basketball does not matter. We only care about the football games because of the condition. Now if we reread re the problem, what is the probability that the game that she attended was a win? Well, four of those games were wins. The total was six. So the probability, in the way that we read this, the probability of a win given that it was football, is going to be 4 out of 6. Now in Khan Academy, it's okay to leave it unreduced or unsimplified, but in, I, in the IXL skill, it has to be reduced. So we're going to say, okay, I can divide numerator and denominator by 2. My final answer is 2 over 3 or 2 thirds. Mrs. Dreyer's class was surveyed about ice cream. Here is the frequency table. It's a little bit bigger, uh, but really not a problem. What is the probability that a randomly selected student prefers strawberry given that the student is a girl? So again, we go looking for the condition. We find the word given in the problem. After that, it says that the student is a girl. So girl is our condition for this problem. Girl is all that matters. We can get rid of all of the data on boy. Doesn't matter. So if we reread re the problem again, what's the probability that a randomly selected student prefers strawberry? Given that we're just talking about the girls, so strawberry, there are three. Total number of girls, if we add it all up there, it's 10. So our probability is 3 out of 10, or 3 tenths. And we cannot reduce that. So that's the answer. 